Okay. Uh, welcome to a bit Uganda e-learning. My name is Nelson, and in today's video, we shall be looking at. Um, we shall be looking at the so-called uh, subtraction. Okay, subtraction of finite what finite systems. Okay, in our recent video, we are able to look at uh, uh, addition of finite system. So in this video, we are going to be looking at how do we subtract this finite system. However, we are able to talk about uh, the definition of finite system itself. That uh, this simply means the way how we count uh, we count uh, our numbers uh, using the remainders. So in this. Uh, we are also able to look at the addition uh, in our recent video. So uh, for this lesson, we shall be able to look at uh, subtraction of uh, finite systems. Okay. So we shall start with examples, and we see how to work out uh, with numbers that requires uh, the subtraction of finite system. Okay. Our example one is here. We have uh, subtract two minus one. Is equal to dash mod 5. Uh, we said mod uh, still uh, simply mean uh, finite. Okay, when it is given, you still use the same method. Then uh, what you do is to go ahead and subtract. Uh, one have our 2 here. Minus 1 is equal to 1 mod 5. So this simply means that our 1 mod 5 is the number that was uh, divided by 5. Uh, is the remainder number which was got after dividing a 5 by a certain what? By uh, a certain number which was 1, okay? So uh, this simply means uh, that uh, this number was uh, the number which was uh, not divided but subtracted and we got a remainder which was 1. Okay, so also here we have at our example 2, they are saying subtract 2 minus 4. Uh, so when you say 2 minus 4, uh, of course uh, it is the impossible. You cannot subtract a 2 from a 4. Of course that is impossible. So what we have to do here when the number that we are subtracting is impossible, uh, we borrow our finite which is 5. Then we add it to the number which is less, okay? So that's why we are able to get our 2, which is less, then plus what? Plus a 5, because we borrow we borrowed our finite, which is 5. Then minus the 4, okay? So this is going to be our 7 minus what? Minus 4. Then we should be able now to get our what? Our finite here, which is... Uh, you get, when you say 4 minus, I mean 7 minus 3, we get a remainder 3. So we shall be able to write our remainder, which is a 3, and then finite 5. Okay, so to practice more on these examples, we have been given some evaluation activity here. They are saying subtract the following, okay? So we are going to do number what? Number 2, uh, number 4. The number six. Okay, so the remaining is be yours. Uh, okay, let's do one by one. We have our three. Okay, it is better if I show out someone that you are going to do what? You are going to work out a what? A solution. Okay, so this is our what? Our solution. So we have our three minus one. Uh, is it being equal to our finite, our finite dash, this is going to be our finite 5, okay, of course this should be in what, in brackets, so uh, here since uh, our first number is even greater than our number that we are subtracting, that simply means we shall be able to get our 2, which is uh, the remainder. We write the what? We write the remainder. Then we say finite. We say finite. We say finite what? Finite 5. Is that okay? 
fine. So uh, that's how we can uh, get that answer. Then we have our figure 4 is 3 minus minus 4. Okay. 3 minus 4. 3 minus 4 finite. Okay, that's finite. Three minus four dash finite what finite five. So when you look at our three here is uh, less than four. So we say our three. Uh, we add the what the finite which is five. Uh, then minus okay. Let me put bracket here minus minus what minus our four. Then we shall be able to get our finite. Our finite what? Finite 5. Should be in bracket. So this simply means we shall be having our... Uh, what is this? Okay, this is our 8. Okay. Let me just rub this. Let me rub this, rub this, rub this. Okay, let me rub this. It was not showing well. Okay, so this is the same as 8 minus what? 8 minus 4. 8 minus 4 is going being equal to dash finite what? Dash finite five. So this simply means we shall now be having our remainder, which is four uh, finite. Our four finite what? Finite five. So this number of ours simply mean that we have. Uh, the number that we subtracted from and, and got uh, our remainder as what? As a 4. Our remainder as what? As a 4. We subtracted our finite, then we uh, got our 4 as what? As our remainder, okay? So, uh, for this, here we have our 4 what? Our 4 minus 3, uh, which is the same as what? This, this is finite. This is finite what? Finite 5. So here we shall be having our uh, 1 finite what? 1 finite what? 1 finite. Our 5. Okay. So this is going to be our what? Our answer for this. Okay, so uh, to make a recap of our, our subtraction of finite is to ensure that uh, we look at uh, uh, the finite itself when it is, when you have the number that can be subtracted or it is less, you have to first borrow uh, the finite itself, okay? You borrow the finite, you borrow the what? You borrow the finite, you add. After adding, then you'll be able to get the number which can be subtracted. And we should be able to write the remainder. After writing the remainder, then uh, you indicate, uh, for example, here you say uh, our one, which was the remainder, which is one, finite what? Finite five. You will have done uh, the right uh, choice for you to get the correct what? The correct answer. So for this, uh, uh, let me be able to stop here. And uh, we shall be able to uh, get or solve in another what? Another, uh, another lesson. So be able to play out on our playlist. Check out on our playlist. Subscribe, comment for us to do the best of your will. Stay blessed. Nice moment.